Um, so this will be our first time introducing ourselves to our neighbors, Alpha. And boy, are they going to be glad to see us. Subsistence, I'm an old guy, gaming, and uh, we got attacked last night by two separate groups of hunters. It was very dark. Uh, I could barely see, uh, but I did record the clips for that, so here they are right now. And so um, those happen, both of those attacks happen after midnight, which means we have two of the three hunter bases with uh, hardly any hunters in them at the moment. So I, I don't know uh, who it was um, because, you know, it was really dark. I couldn't see what direction they were coming from. Um, but Bravo's not ready for us to attack yet again anyway. It's too soon. Uh, so we're going to go say hello to Alpha. Uh, check them out and then maybe even peek around Charlie's base a little bit. If, if I don't see anybody at all walking outside their base, um, then Charlie was probably also who attacked us. However, we don't have any grenades at all, so what we're going to have to do... Um, actually, no, you know what? I think we can make a grenade. Um, here, let's see. Yeah, we, we can actually make a grenade. Um, so let's make ourselves one nade here. And if we had two more pieces of iron, ooh, we are going to get two more pieces of iron. We can make actually another grenade too, right? Yeah. Okay, yeah, let's just wait for those other two pieces of iron. That way we can take two grenades. Uh, one to bust into Alpha and then one to bust into Charlie's front door if we, you know, decide to go after them. And we might even find another grenade um, at Alpha's base. Okay, so cool, we got that. Um, so let's see. We need to eat something. I made some liver and onions there. Let's eat one of those, and that should take care of our protein. Let's just throw down some blueberries there, and that should take care of our our carbs. We just need one more iron fragment, and we can build that second grenade. I'm uh, in the process of making some boards, too, as you can see. And while we're waiting for that, uh, I checked the crops before um, I started the camera and they're in pretty good shape. The chicken's in pretty good shape, so I don't think we need to worry about them. So let's get this second grenade made up. There we go. Put that in there. Put this stuff back here. And, uh, yeah, I think we're ready to go. Oh, we I do want, we do need to make some more picks, though, too. 
Um, so let's see, what do we need? Board, scrap, and cordage. So let's make, let's make two full picks because it's gonna take us one grenade and one full pick to break through each door. And if we're lucky after we break into alpha, we might, they might have a grenade for us too. Um, yeah, okay. Put that stuff back there. And we got two nades. Okay, we got three health packs, we got three bandages. I think we're good to go. Ah, uh, so let's go. The other thing too is uh, I got a lockpick, so once we clear alpha, then we then we can actually loot the birchwood for uh, birchwood forest, and uh, hopefully we'll find a locked creek whilst we're over there. Um, so I'm I'm thinking it's probably likely that it was Alpha and Charlie that attacked us, but you know again I don't know that for sure. It is possible that Bravo would retaliate on the very night that they spawn back in. I'm, I I think they can do that, but they don't always do that. And like I said, we want to avoid Bravo anyways because. They haven't built their stuff back up yet enough for us to make it worth for worth it for us to go raid them. Um, so this will be our first time introducing ourselves to our neighbors, Alpha. And boy, are they going to be glad to see us. Well, maybe not. <laughs> they probably won't be so glad to see us. Uh, even if they're there at all. I mean, you know, like I said, we, we killed them, those two groups last night. So it's very, very possible that there's nobody at all outside the base. There's still probably going to be the one dude inside, but that's, you know, that's the usual. And it uh, looks like we have a bear or something kind of wandering around up by their base. So we'll have to kind of watch out for him, rather not mess with him, waste ammo, that sort of thing. So Alpha's only going to have a chest for us. They're not going to have, well, they should have a refiner, though. And of course a fireplace, but they're not going to have a workbench, which basically means, um, you know, we can't use their power or mass to make anything like we can with Bravo. And then of course, Charlie has like everything and then some. Okay. All right. So there they are right there. Uh, we do need to watch out for the Claymore too. I don't hear anything. Oh, now I do. Oh, they are out here. Okay. Let's see what side they're going to come around. Is it just the one guy? got our two shotgun shells back. I still hear footsteps in there. Okay, we really got to watch out for claymores. All right, I think we're good because the claymores aren't this close to their base. Oh, man, I hope that bear doesn't cause us trouble. Ugh. Go away, bear. Okay, so that guy is inside. There's a building crate right there. Oh, man, that bear's going to be a pain in the ass. Okay, let's do this. Okay, what's that bear doing? Okay, I'm going to start banging on the door. And there's crates all over the place. And hopefully that bear will steer clear of us, but I'll just keep an eye on him. Okay, here we go. Okay, there still could be someone upstairs. There is someone upstairs. There's his foot right there. All 
All right. Okay. So maybe it was an elf that attacked us. <laughs> That's all right. They needed to be raided sooner or later. Okay, so we got lots of shotgun shells. Ooh, we got ingots. We need ingots. Uh, yeah. This is a pretty good chest because of the ingots, uh, mostly. Uh, but lots of shotgun shells, too. I'll take it. All right, let's take this and this and this. And they... I don't think they have, uh, have anything up here that we can loot. Uh, oh, no, they do. Yeah, they... Oh, look at that. 17 iron fragments. No, 21 iron fragments. Even better. Even better. Okay. Let's turn all their stuff on to wear their power out. We took all of that. Yeah, see, that's all really pretty, pretty much all Alpha has. We'll burn all their fuel out. They don't even have a mass generator. Um, okay, cool. So what this means now is that we have free run of... The Birchwood Forest. Uh, we we got to be careful of their claymore, though. There's almost certainly... One. Oh, that's it right there. Oh, my goodness. I thought that was a... <laughs> crap. I thought that was a, 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 a crate. I want to look at it more closely before we got too much closer. Okay, cool. So, let's uh, let's go ahead and loot the Birchwood. Um, but we're going to also work our way over towards Charlie and just see... You know, if we can see any activity down there. Because we... We can certainly break in at least to their first floor. Um, but if you don't know how Charlie works, they've got multiple floors, and each floor has a locked room with a, with a chest in it. And, um, you know, so you have to break all those doors down to get to everything, and I don't have the resources to do that. But um, we might be able to, like I said, get in at least get into their first floor. We don't want to waste too much time. Well, yeah, we're okay. We, gotta, we still got about a half a day yet left okay we got two bears over that way let's ignore them so we don't waste any ammo and we'll run off over this way we're gonna leave alpha's uh claymore in place so we know know where it is might as well take this too we'll put the burn meat in the mass recycler let's go get this building crate here Okay, so we're just going to kind of do a quick sweep back and forth looking for any locked crates. Uh, that's the Claymore. Oh, look at that! I was going to say, that looks like kind of like a locked crate over there. We found it. All right, hot darn. We might have an inventory problem now. Um, okay, so let's grab these. Nice, 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 nice. Look at all those rifle uh, bullets. Uh, we can get all of these. We'll just eat these right now because, um, I, yeah, I don't have any. All right, we can take those and those. So we have to make room for two items. So what we're going to do is we're going to turn... Do I have any cordage? Yes. Okay, so we're going to turn all this into cordage and take those, and then we're going to... Uh, I guess eat these to take the glass. All right, nice. Well, that was good. <laughs> um, nope, we can't. We can't loot that. All right, we are completely full. Here's what we're gonna do. Though. We're gonna walk over towards Charlie and uh, just take a look and see if we can spot anyone walking around the base. Uh, because you know there were so there there were so many people at Alpha. I'm starting to think it wasn't Alpha that. Uh, attacked us at all last night and which means it would have had to have been charlie and bravo most likely uh, so let's just go, go take a peek over there but uh, even if we do decide to go after them today we still have to run back to the base and drop stuff off because we just don't have room right now in our inventory yeah that wasn't that was pretty pretty easy peasy finding all that stuff and you know the the lock crate and everything all right we're being uh, pursued by a bear. So, oh, there's another bear. So let's kind of run them back up the river. Um, there's some ore up there that I would like to get. Okay, I think we're good. Let's run around this way. Um, we don't have room for an onion, do we? Nope, we don't. Okay. Okay. 
And we don't have room for a chicken either. Okay, those bears are over there. I uh, really would like to get that iron. Okay, we're gonna ha uh, we're gonna give up this, I guess. We got plenty of that stuff because um, I really want to get this iron. We need it bad. The cop. Well, we already have copper ore, don't we? No, we don't. Okay. Well, we're gonna leave the copper. We got lots of copper. Uh, it's the iron that we need. Okay, let's just kind of see what's going on over here. They're still building, by the way, too. They're not finished with that structure. Um, it gets pretty big. It's, it's a... Oh, I keep forgetting. <laughs> Habitual looting. Okay, so we do have a guy out there. All right, well, let's not mess with them with all this valuable loot or inventory. Let's go back to the base, drop it off, and then uh, kind of assess what we want to do. I don't have room for... Oh, I do have kelp. Okay. It's getting to the point where it's almost too late to to hit them. Um, but again, there's it, it would be foolish for me to try and hit them now with a full inventory because I'm not going to have room for whatever loot we might get. Plus, there's always that risk that we could get killed and then we would lose a lot of stuff too, which would be no bueno, man. Look at all those clams down there, but we don't have time for that right now. Let's get on back to the base and just drop stuff off and see where we're at. Okay, let's make another grenade. Um, so that way we'll have two grenades if we do decide to go after them, and we'll be able to get into their place much more quickly. Okay, we'll put all that stuff in there. All of this goes in here. No, not those. Okay, so we have two nades. Um, let's just put that in there. I know it doesn't have water in it. Uh, but we gotta move. We gotta move. We gotta move. So the sun is... It's early afternoon, so I think we can do this. I think we can do this. Um, let's actually swim to the shore and then run over there, because it'll be a little faster than trying to swim across. Let's also get this reloaded. Look at that clam right there, man. Right there for the taking. Okay, so we know they have at least one guy wandering around outside. So we're ha we're going to have to kind of figure out the best cover that we can attack them from. Unfortunately, we don't have a lot of good trees to stand behind. Sort of kind of have this rock here, but it's not ideal. Okay, that's their front door there. Okay, someone's attacking us. Oh, man, that was close. <laughs> I was just thinking to myself, man. Oh, no, they got an armored door. Oh, no. Hmm. See, when I attack these guys... In s it's 1100. When I attack these guys in s season one, I always used a breaching charge, which takes the door down automatically. I wonder if they're attacking us right now. I mean, there's obviously one guy inside. Crap. Okay, that's 1500. This is 1100. Well, I wonder how much a grenade damage a grenade will do to this. Um. Oh, there's two claymores. There's one there and one there. Ooh, sneaky. I didn't know they could use two claymores. Okay, let's just see what this does. It set that claymore off. Okay, um, now let's check the damage here. They got it down to 880. Hmm, okay. Let's try it again. Okay, now what did it do? 662. Um Yeah, I don't I don't have enough pick to do this. I'd have to go back to the base and make another pick. 
<clears throat> hmm. Well, I don't think I have enough to make another grenade. Maybe I do. I don't think I do. Yeah, I don't know. I don't, I don't think this is going to work. I don't think this is going to work. Because we're at 612 right now. I should have looked to see if I could actually make a breaching charge. Hmm. Well, yeah, the problem, guys, is we're out of time. If I if I had more time, I would run back, make some more picks, come back and break them down, but I just don't think we're going to have enough time to do this. So let's um Let's head on back. Yeah, we're we're gonna have to we're gonna have to wait until we can make a breaching charge before we hit these guys. Um, so they they get off easy this time. Oh, look, they're coming back! They're coming back. Maybe we can at least kill them, right? Okay, he's dead. All right. Well, we killed two of their guys, so at least uh, you know, we get a little bit of of loot for for our trouble. Nice, we got a stairwell too. Is that all of them? Just those two. Okay. All right, well, you know what? All in all, not a bad day. Can't complain. We took Alpha out. We found a locked chest in front of Alpha's house. And uh, we let Charlie know that, uh, you know, we're not going to put up with their crap. <laughs> we just didn't quite have enough resources and time to... Uh, to actually breach breach through but we will we definitely will and you know we, we killed two of them anyways so yeah I'm, I'm not I'm not at all unhappy with the way this episode went I think it went pretty good um so let's see um we're probably gonna go ahead and wrap this one up a little bit early just because there's not really anything more to do at this point I need to go back to the base uh, resituate build up resources, you know, to get some more lock picks made so we can, you know, continue uh, having those on us for locked crates. And, you know, we're going to, we're going to, of course, get retaliation from Alpha and Charlie, but I mean, it doesn't matter. They keep attacking us anyway, so who cares, right? Uh, but, you know, my little base set up here uh, with them getting trapped and whatnot is, is just working out fabulously. In fact, there might, you know what, there might be uh, another one, one of them over here trapped underneath. Let's see before I let you guys go. Uh, we're going to need some light. And let's put this back in here. Because they're, you know, they, they tend to get trapped underneath my my little dock here. And they, they don't even fight back. I mean, I've been killing them with, with my axe just to save ammo because it's an easy kill. Let's see if any of them are stuck under here. No, doesn't look like it this time. Okay, cool. Nobody around there? Nope. All right, you guys. Well, yep, I think we're going to wrap up this episode. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment to share the video. And we'll catch you in the next episode. Hi, Chicken. This is my friend Chicken. Don't tell him what's going to happen to him, though, when it's all said and done. Because then he probably wouldn't be my friend anymore. Bye.